What's up, my crazy people today? This is your boy, AsuJo18, aka Giovanni Huerta, and welcome to the Pokemon Sword and Shield Shady Lock episode 18. Now, on the last episode, crazy stuff happened. As you can see, we just finished the fighting type gym. Now, moving on forward, we are actually gonna go ahead and move on. Actually, I'm kind of scared because on the last episode, if you guys have not checked it out already, you definitely should because a lot of intense things happened in that very episode. If you can see right here, I don't need to further explain. There's, If you guys have been here since episode 16, you'll see a little bit of a change around here. Now that's no spoilers because you don't know what exactly Pokemon I lost. Unless you take the time to see every single Pokemon and blah blah blah, you know. But, anyways, we have... Whoa! That, I think that was my throat going... <laughs> that was weird. But anyways, we are now... Officially at the level 37 March, more mark kind of, but everyone is like in the point of like different sections. Like we got 35s, 36, 37, 31s, and 29s. Now we gotta bump those levels up. So I might at any point do like a little mini grinding montage, going doing raid battles and any of that sort. So that's where I might be going. So let's continue on. Okay, I don't know what. Oh, it's a Yamper. Yo, Sonya, let me get in y'all. Alright. Uh, looks like my yapper really likes you, huh? Anyway, we run into each other at a good time. You know, the mirror here in Stone side, it's set to tell the story of the hero of Galar as well. Though what there's at today is actually a replica of the ancient art that used to be here. Hmm. You tend to have surprisingly sharp insights, so I was wondering what you might think when you see the ruins. Kaboom! I mean, kaboom. What? What in the world was that? Sounds like it came from the direction of the ruins, too. Oh, let's have a look. Come along, Yamper. I guess we're gonna have to go ahead and be the hero and go ahead and bike it over there. So let's try to make it as fast as we can because we don't want to waste one single bit of this episode. Okay, let's see. Yo! Okay, I'm a little scared because this is bead. <clears throat> uh, destroy it. Destroy it all. We're gonna find those wishing stars. Oh. We've gotta bring the chairman more wishing stars if we wanna please him. You know? Cobra. Ooh. If you're truly the chairman's Pokemon, then you should feel grateful for this chance to help him find wishing stars. Yo, 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 chill. Hey. Yo, be chill. Oh my, you again. So the thing you got, you can start collecting wishing stars now and get in the chairman's favor, eh? That's the way of things, is it? I see. So you do have some cunning in you, but I won't have it. I won't allow anyone stand in my way. Fudge! Okay, wait, hold on a second. You have a duosion. Now that is problematic. But you know what? Since I'm not that... Under, oh, okay, yeah, you know what? I think this is the best chance to just go into Mina. And I think Mina could deal with this, honestly. I think Mini, Mina could deal with one of his Pokemon. Then I, I'm gonna go straightly off. Straightly off. I'm gonna go straight off into Inteleon. And Inteleon should be able to do the trick. And I should be... Oh, okay, do not... Alright, I'm gonna go for the, the flinches. Please go for the flinches and hit flinch, flinch, baby, flinch. It's worked. <laughs> I've received more than enough to judge you and your team's abilities. You don't know nothing about me, Bead. You know, I just flinched you. That's just why I love Air Slash so much. It's pulled through many, many times for me. Bye-bye, Duosian. You're gone. You're out and about. That's all you need to know. All right, Mikasa is level 36. Hopefully, fingers crossed. This means that Mikasa is officially evolving. Now we got Gotharita. Okay. So before anything else, how? Oh crap. That's eh, fine. Gothita. Uh, I was going to switch into Inteleon, but you know what? Let's go for another Air Slash. Nah, there's no harm in doing so. This should be an easy. Uh, shoot. Fake Tears. I had that, didn't I? I lowest accuracy. Ooh, yikes. Okay, let's go for another air slash. I should be fine. 
This air slash should not. Please, bitch. Bitch. Oh, okay. Perfect, perfect. You're done. That's it. That's it for this guy. Uh, got, I mean, girl, whatever. So, we're gonna go ahead. I believe air cutter has 100% accuracy. Well, it's equally the same. Alright, let's just go in air cutter. This should be more than enough. Ooh, okay. I see you. I see you. Okay. Air cutter should just be equally the same amount. Oh, actually, no, it won't. Okay, I'm gonna go. Uh, I had to go for the air cutter. I'm using too much PP than I should be using. Alright, Gothita. Gotharita is down. Definitely now I have to switch out. Okay. So I'm definitely gonna go out in two. You're gonna send in Hatrium. Who's this? Wherever it is, I'm gonna go and send in Inteleon because Inteleon's probably my best lead right now. And. Come on, Inteleon. Please let this be something. Hmm. Okay. So I will go for a snipe shot and hopefully this does something and does not have a grass type move. Please don't. Oh my shoo! Whoa! Yo! Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that snipe shot just did me in. <laughs> that did me. Ponyta. I know, I know this is not a, like, I need a pair, uh, poison type, but I don't have any poison type, so I might as well just stay in. <laughs> I have to win this for the champion. Do you really think I'll let you keep me from winning this? Well, it, I know it's still a Ponyta. I know you're level 33. I'm a little overleveled. Okay, I'll just snipe shot it. Why not? Just snipe shot it. Psh! Go! Oh my god! Oh my god, yo! Low tension, yo. I, I think, man, Intelligence is gonna be. Oh my god, he's such a badass. Um, <clears throat> this has to be some kind of mistake, I demand a do over. Well, there ain't no do overs. Actually, this is probably the easiest battle I've ever had. Just just saying, FYI. But why? How could this be? How could someone like you get in my way? Hmm, I was just. I was the one chosen by the chairman. I was the one who was to defeat the champion. I'm one of the elite, someone who can shoulder the future of the Gala region. Ah, challenge, challenge your bead. Hmm. I wonder what you're up to when you ask the bottles. Chairman Rose's Copra. I can't believe you try to use the Chairman's Pokemon to destroy a historical site. Huh. Who cares? For some reason, ruin when the next thousand years are at stake. Do you stand in the path of a Pokemon simple beam or something? How do you expect to support the chairman with that sort of thinking? <laughs> oh, young bead. It pains me to have to say this, but I am truly disappointed. It's true that I am the one who found you, but back when, back when you were all alone. I saw talent in you. You reminded me a little bit of myself back when I was young. That's why I sent you to a trainer school to give you a chance at success. But try to destroy the mural part of Galar's history. You show no love toward Galar. You're clearly not a worthy challenger for the gym challenge. We will decide what to do with you later. For now, you will return to Hammerlock. Oh, she. Damn, he got me gonna get it. You must be joking, right? You're just calling me from the gym challenge, but you're the one who endorses me. There are a hundred ways we could sort this out. Why are you choosing the worst possible option? Oh, challenger bead. I will be taking those wishing stars that you've gathered. Yo, that is some rude. <laughs> Whoa. Oh. Uh. Oh, so new and also awesome routine too. Terrible shame, all this. An absolute disaster. I never wish to see us lose challenges for this sort of reason. Yet we do what we must to do to keep things fair and sportsman's like. Huh. You know, I still want to take down B, you know what I'm saying? Uh, B, uh, just destroy him. I want to see that rapid dash. Alright. You know, during one of B's matches, I heard the announcer say that B has no family. Apparently, it was Rose who took Bede under his wing, and so Bede was battling for the chairman's sake. Huh. 
What an awful turn of events. I hope the mirror survived all that. True, true, true. All too true. But, to be fair, or to... Uh-oh. Sorry, I think I burped again. <laughs> My bad. Gamers burp, right? Am I right? That is a sword Pokemon. Huh. Oh, Sonya, you connecting the dots. She about going some FBI stuff right here. She analyzing everything. She's like, yo, that is dot Pokemon, blah, blah, blah. That, that's what it sounds like. Sonya knows what she's doing. And I'm just here like an idiot not knowing what he's talking about. But anyways. Not a brilliant turn of events. But the ruins were brought into the light for us to see. You see? What does it tell us about Galar's legends? A sword and a shield? Right, more than any hero, there's those things that appear to be Pokemon that stand out. Not just that, but those Pokemon appear to be holding a sword and a shield as if they were using them. You see? Anything else look interesting to you? Mm. Uh, the hero is actually two people? No. Well, I don't know what tapestries are. Oh, good observation! There were really, there really were two heroes. But if that's the case, then why only the statue at the Badoo drop in? Hmm. More than any statue of a hero or an old tapestry, these ruins, made in truly ancient times, must show us the real truth. Which means, the sword is a Pokemon. Yep. I was thinking the same thing. Seems like at some point in history, the sword and shield were combined with the two actual Pokemon and treated as the same thing. But then what? They just waited for mystery? Two young heroes. The sword and the shield were actually Pokemon, but why would the truth of these runes be hidden when their stories were depicted in artwork? Huh. With your help, I really feel like we made a big discovery here. Thanks. I'll give you a couple of these, so you keep giving it your best in the gym challenge too, okay? Guess you'll be headed to Bologna Licks, right? Girl. How many times do I gotta tell you that two revives don't help me in this situation? They cannot revive my dead silly cobras. Jeez. Alright. So, if you guys do not already know, these are the legendary Pokemons. And I'm just assuming there's a king and another king or something from two different kingdoms. That's, that's my biggest, like, if I had to assume anything, that'd probably be it. But officially, we are done with Bea. The gym leader of Lostness, so... Honestly, I... So, Farfetch has not evolved yet. I was I was so busy on the storyline, I didn't even think about Farfetch. Jeez. I guess we're gonna continue on the story path of wherever this is. Hopefully we're actually taking in a good area, you know? There's a lot of... Whoa! Alright, two full heals. Unfortunately, we can't catch anything else aside from what we already have, so... Ooh... Yo, it could bring up the light. I see TMs in the distance, and I see more of those... Uh, Alright, we'll fight more of these people. Eh. Yo, Chip. Yo, man, I, I, I know you're looking for some mushrooms, but don't tell me you're eating mu the wrong type of mushrooms here, buddy. You're sending out milk. Free. Man, that looks good. Like, you would just eat it like marshmallows. I wonder if you're a marshmallow Pokemon. Oh, you're not very effective to this, but you are weak to... Huh. Well, you have Steel Wings, so I'm actually gonna bounce. I'm actually gonna go ahead and bounce into... Jeez. Nothing, nothing too good. Actually. Let's see. Let's go into Steel Wing. I don't think this this thing could one hit KO me. Okay, I was a little afraid to be honest at first that this thing was gonna wreck me, but I guess not. So by the look that is a its weakness is to steal. I'm assuming. Oh, I didn't even see what Pokemon it was. It's a Shinook. Isn't this a poison? Oh, I forgot what this thing was. Uh, I think it's a poison. Uh, it just reminds me of something from uh, Plants vs. Zombies. I actually do not know the typing for this scene. So I'm actually going to go ahead and bounce off into Mina. And fingers crossed that this scene is not a grass type. 
Or I mean, this is not something that is super effective against Mina. Screw you. Screw you. Screw you, Shroon Shinook. But I believe you are a grass type. I think you are. You're either a fairy. I was right. You were a grass type. <sighs> All right. That was good predictions. So she she nook she shenotic. I think it's shenotic. I don't know why I said she nook, but I think it's just shenotic. So let's let this air cutter do the job and bye bye shenok shenotic or whatever your name, whatever your Pokemon name. I think you're sixth gen, I believe, or seventh gen. You know, I I don't keep it up. I don't keep up with the gens. Okay. This is Sinistia. So we're gonna go ahead and go into Loteji, the one that I truly believe is gonna be my superior Pokemon. Aside from, um, what was it? Mina? Oh wow, I already forgot her name. Ooh, what is this? I haven't seen this. Alright, let me snipe shot you. Well played. I'll say that. I will say that. Alright. Alright. Oh, Sorry rubbing my nose here on cam. <laughs> oh hey. Come on, Mikasa, I need you to evolve or something, girl. I mean I mean Come on. You gotta evolve some sometime, girl. I need you to evolve. I don't even know where I'm supposed to be going. Oh wait, is this an item or is this a Pokemon I'm encountering? Okay. I can't see, but I see items. Bright powder. Can I go this way? No, I can't. Yikes. Okay. So I'm assuming I'll have to head straight over here or something like that. Okay, yep. Yep. I'm heading in the right path. Big roots. Not surprised. Hey, I think. Here's a TM. There you go. Okay, what's with these, like, dumb TMs? I'm not saying they're dumb, but, like, I don't know. I don't know how to say it. <gasps> okay, let me, before I do any of that, let's go ahead and use super potions for you, definitely, and you. Okay, so, I wonder if Pinky evolves in, like, a couple of levels from now. If not, then, oh well. So let's go and take on this double battle. That I believe these two could take on. Yeah. Nah, nah. It's fine. It's fine. You're Anita and you're John. Alright. I I just... Okay, never mind. It's Robert and Jacqueline. It's a, another okay name. But... But it's... it's Okay, it's a nine tail, So that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. So we got a Curlia that I'm gonna have to definitely switch out on. Because I am... Mikasa, you're not gonna deal with that. So I'm gonna swap you with Mina. And whoa, what was that? I heard. I just heard. A, okay, whatever. Never mind. I think that's from me. Jeez. Okay, I don't even know what I'm just thinking about. All right. I think I should be good. I mean, not better. Everyone, be everyone better not just start attacking me. Yo, I'm telling you, man. Lotet Jesus is gonna be the destroyer. Okay, Mikasa. This this is your moment. This is your moment. I I knew that you were gonna hit this guy already. Okay. So you're gonna go ahead and air cutter. And I'm just gonna go ahead and you turn. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and just water pulse you. That should be more than enough. It won't Oko though. That's sure. It won't Oko. Yes. I guess this is a one shot guy, man. I I, I don't play with this guy. Come on, Sir Fetch. I really want to Sir Fetch in this episode. Please. Please may this couple be with me. Please give me this evolution. Please, Sir Fetch. Sir Fetch. Okay. Not Sir Fetch, but Pinky's evolving. What are you involving into, Pinky? Let's go. Dark and Fairy. Ooh. Yo. He evolved into Morgan. Morgrim. 
but he, he I know he's supposed to resemble Gremlin, right? Or I think I said that right. He reminds me of one of those people from not the Smurfs. I was that one where uh, Justin Timberlake sang that song in the tr the trolls. There you go, the trolls. I think it's called the trolls. Yo, oh, come on, another evolution, please. What are you, a dark and fairy type? All right, I'm assuming you have a third evolution. Fingers crossed. When it gets down in all fours, as if to beg for forgiveness, it's trying to lure opponents in so that it can stab them with its spear-like hair. Yo. Okay, another evolution. What do you want to learn? False surrender? Forget an old move. I don't know what false surrender is, but frick it. It is an 80. The user pretends to bow its head, but then it stabs the target with its disenveiled hair. This attack... Yo. I'm sorry, but that's better than assurance. That is way better than assurance. Yo, you're actually becoming quite useful, my friend. Yo, Pinky. Yo, Surfetch. Surfetch, please, Surfetch. Surfetch! God damn it. Are you like level 38 or something? Man. What type of bullcrap is this? Uh, okay, two eye propulsions. I'll gladly take those, even though I can't even use them during battle, so. <sighs> Whatever. Oh, another battle. Uh, I'll battle as many as I have to. I really, really, really badly want one. Just sign it. I just really, really want a, a surf fetched in this battle. Oh, what are you? What are you? I'm seeing so many YouTube videos. I know it's indie dd but ooh, Mikasa, Mikasa, please, please, please. I don't know what type of you are. So Pinky, I, I don't trust you at the moment, Pinky. It's, it's not a you thing. It's just I don't trust you at the moment. You're not a very high enough level, which I should. Ooh, it's a fairy type. That's what I'm getting at. You're a fairy type. Are you? You're not a psychic type, are you? Okay, so you're a psychic type. Definitely. So you're a psychic and fairy, or what's up? So you lowered my attack. Good thing I'm not attack. I'm actually special attack. So that's a bonus on my side. But you're a tank! Yo! Okay, let's go for one more air slash, because... I gotta consume my PP as little as possible. And I think that was enough to... Alright. Come on, Pinky. I really want Pinky to evolve. Or, I mean, another indie? Let me see. Since... I'm assuming you're, uh... E this... This guy. Can he do it? Okay, I'm, I'm screwed. I'll, I'll, I'll jump into him and let's see. Because it's another NDD. And it's using Psychic, which I should be super effective. And yo! It looked like he was a shiny version. So, I am two levels under level, under leveled, but... I hope Buck Bite is more than enough. Shouldn't be very effective or anything. Or, if anything, it should just be a complete sweep. Come on, come on. Yo! Yo, my, my dude, my dude! Yo, my dude! I think I should put you up in the front, you know? Actually, I might as well put you guys up in the front. I, got, I gotta get you guys some levels. <sighs> because, uh... So, I definitely want to see some... Some peaky action in here before you actually evolves and everything. You Batman, you guys are all doing great. And before anything big happens, I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys some super potions so you guys are fully healed up before the battle comes. All right, eh, that's that's fine. All right, yo, I'm I'm enjoying my Pokemon. Oh, damn it! All right, I gotta go ahead in a full rotation, full rotation. Okay, now that that way. This way, I'm trying to get whatever item that is, and it's 
not helping that I'm going the wrong way. Oh, here are the Mulgrims. These are the Dark and Fairy types. Okay. Oh, these are 38? Huh. Okay. Okay. So I have officially entered dangerous territory. Alright. Ooh! Whoa, 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 wait, 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 why did I even go into him? My question, what was going through my mind? Uh, I think it's only weak to fairy. Actually, what is dark and fairy's only weakness? Oh, I know what it is. It's steel. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna go into low G and then hope that I can run away. This is my only option I really have at the moment. So this is not my encounter though, I caught Pinky. Okay. Good to know. So I'm gonna go ahead and run away. That really caught me off surprise. Okay, that really caught me off surprise. I really did not think a level 38 would be in this area. Huh. Well, you learn something new every day. So, before I go and encounter it again. Oh, wait! I should have taken. Oh, what? Never mind. If I encounter it again, I'm gonna destroy it. Uh, is it. No. No. Okay, that was just a. Wait. I think I'm supposed to go here. Can I get it? Can I get it? Okay, I got U turn. I mean, sure. Give me U turn after this. Lay into the game, but okay. Can I go down here? Can I go down here? Yep. Okay. Uh, no. Oh, this way. All right. So I'm pretty much in the clear for right now. I think so. Yeah. So let's go ahead and do this again. Blah blah blah. I should have just battled that trainer. Gosh dang it. Okay. So now I'm officially in a brand new area. Oh, I'm actually in Balonea. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Hmm. Whoa. What is this? I kind of like this area. But is this? Scorn Bunny and Sizzle Pea are different species, but they're still both Pokemon. Scorn and I. Wait, wait, what? <laughs> what? It can be one? Oh, wait, 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 what? Okay, never mind. What? Okay, um. Ugh, don't tell me this is a fairy gym. It is a fairy gym. Ooh, this is really scaring me. <sighs> Who's in charge of this gym? Yeah, definitely. I'm not gonna go into this gym with these levels. Yeah, as you can see. So definitely, I'm gonna go ahead and go into the wild area by the looks of it because these levels that I'm in currently no thank you i am definitely not doing it no no thank you so so i could definitely buy more things that's a good thing so i'm gonna go ahead and buy some hyper potions and go stack up on some of those all right that should be more than enough so therefore i'm gonna go ahead and as a matter of fact i'm gonna go ahead and train so from here on out i just want to say Thank you very much for watching this episode of the Pokemon Sword and Shield. Now, from here on out, it's just going to be a pure grinding montage. So, if you want to stick through that, then you're by all means free to do so. But, I really want to do some grinding montage. Mon bleh, montage. And when I mean grinding montage, I'm going to go ahead and go to the wild area and train as much as I can to get them all around 38 or I don't know. 
Maybe 38 seems like a good range. I want Mikasa to evolve. I want Pinky to be all leveled up. Batman especially. So you might see Batman with an evolution through the grinding montage. I don't know. But also, don't forget to like this video. Subscribe if you haven't already. And if you guys are new subscribers, if before you even subscribe, actually, as a matter of fact, just subscribe right now. Go to my playlist and click something you like. So without further ado, I will be seeing you in the next episode.